So this tutorial is going to be um, how to blow dry curly hair straight. Uh, there are a couple of techniques that I use. Um, sorry, my phone just went off. There are a couple of techniques that I use um, to get my hair straight, and I tell you the different techniques as um, as I go through the tutorial. Um, but I just want to tell you, you know, right off the bat, um, the things that you'll need. The first thing that you'll need is a blow dryer, and there are blow dryers that come with attachments. So you're going to want to get a blow dryer that has um, the concentrator attachment, and that just concentrates the airflow. Um, then you'll also need a round brush. Um, for curly hair, you're going to want a brush that's um, about a two inch barrel, and there are a lot of different brushes out there, but definitely get. Um, one with soft bristles and it has the metal part um, on the middle. I actually have my brush right here. So um, this brush in particular is, um, the brand is called Tool Science, but it, this gold part in the middle is metal and it heats up um, with the heat of the blow dryer. And then the bristles are all soft bristles, not plastic. Um, and this really helps to just pull that hair, pull the curl right out. Um, and make it straight. Uh, and then you can um, get a flat iron to go through and just smooth it out. And then get a smoothing serum that when you're completely done blow drying your hair, you just put a dime sized amount in the palm of your hand, rub your hands together, run um, some of the product through your fingers, and then just smooth it over your hair. And that's just like a finishing touch and you're good to go. No hairspray, nothing, and your hair will end up looking like this. And um, it's soft, it's smooth, it's flat, it's not frizzy, it's, you know, just, it's like a professional blow dry at home. So if you're interested in finding out how I got this look, then just keep watching. The next step is going to be to detangle your hair. You're going to detangle your hair with a wide tooth comb. The reason for that is the curls can go in between the wide teeth of the comb as opposed to a thin comb. You're going to start by detangling your hair from tip to root. So you start that at the ends and then work your way up until you get to the root. The next step in this process is going to be to apply a straightening cream. I have two creams here. Um, I'm not going to use both of them at the same time, but I just wanted to show you two different ways. Apply the product in my hand and I'm not because I'm going to use several applications I'm not going to use too much at first but just a little palm full rub it in between the palms and in between the fingers and I'm going to start applying that from the tip up to the root just making sure I grab all the hair and then applying it over the roots okay the next step um, after you've applied all your straightening cream um, is to section the hair off. So first I start by sectioning it in half and then into quarters. So I've done the half right here and I just am using these duckbill clips um, and the reason that they're called that is obvious because it looks like a duckbill. Um, so I sectioned it in half and then now I'm going to do a quarter and it's going to be four quarters but I'm just doing half. So I'm going to section off that front quarter and then just looping it around in a bun and then just tying it down with the duckbill clip. And this is to keep each section separate and keep it out of your way while you're working. And I just use two clips to really hold it in place. And then now I have the back section out, and now I'm going to section off the part that I'm going to start blow drying. And you want to blow dry in really small, manageable sections. So I'm going to start from the bottom and work my way up, so that's the section that I'm going to blow dry. And then I just pin this part up, and I'm just using uh, 
some mini duckbill clips. And now we're ready to start blow drying. And the trick with blow drying is when you're blow drying curly hair, the first two inches of the hair shaft is what you want to focus on getting dry. Um, the ends will dry really quickly because they're porous and they absorb um, the air a lot quicker. Um, but the roots of the hair is always really the healthiest part of your hair and it's not very porous. So uh, you'll see me concentrating a lot of airflow on the, the root. Um, and as I said, that's the first two inches of the hair shaft. So I'm going to turn on my blow dryer and stop talking. <laughs> I've continued using my method of um, focusing my blow dry on the first two inches of the shaft, making sure that's dry, and then focusing it out onto the ends. And for each section, I have flat ironed um, right after I've blow dried it. And just running my flat iron right through the hair. And I like to just concentrate a little extra heat right at the ends just to keep that nice and thin and smooth. And so when I get right to the ends, I just like to pull the heat through very slowly. And just keeping it nice and thin right at the ends. And using the same method, I'm going to go through each section of the hair. So now that I'm done with one section, and I just want to turn around and show you that one quartered section. Now I'm going to pin that up. Okay, now that I have this whole side blow dried and flat ironed, I'm going to go ahead and pin this side up and work on the next I have side. just finished my third section. And now I'm just going to pin this all up and uh, work on my last section. Okay, now that I'm done with the last of the flat ironing, what I'm going to do uh, to finish up this uh, curly to straight look is to use a smoothing serum over the hair. Um, a popular one, and one that works really well, is uh, Silk Therapy by BioSilk. Just this small bottle is $14. Um, they have bigger bottles that are $17. But I don't blow dry my hair um, very often, so the small bottle has lasted me a year, actually. Um, yeah, I bought it last Christmas. So, uh, so what you do, I like to just shake it up a little bit, and then apply a dime-sized amount in the palm of my hand. Apply a dime-sized amount in the palm of my hand and work it in between my fingers and then just run my fingers through my hair and smooth it over. Then turn your head to the side and run your fingers through the side of your hair. And then repeat the same on the other side.
And now your hair is done. Cause now I'm that bitch You'll never get to Can't get what you want So you're acting